into some golf now and some local golf that is the sea biscuit johannesburg chef school hosted a golf day challenger for the fundraising to help students from underprivileged backgrounds to for funds to gather their studies the sea biscuit johannesburg chef school has changed its focus from the kitchen to the golf course in a commendable gesture, the school held a golf day challenge to raise money for the students from disadvantaged backgrounds who need to support their path to the higher education. The occasion went beyond the boundaries of food by bringing together passionate golfers and the neighborhood in an effort to improve the lives of the deserving students. We are hosting a fundraiser for the Seabiscuit Foundation. Um, the purpose of the fundraiser is to actually get funds so we can get more students sponsored through the Johannesburg Culinary and Pastry School. So the Seabiscuit Foundation is basically a sister company of the Joba Culinary and Pastry School because we find that a lot of kids come into the culinary school wanting to become chefs but they are not able to fund themselves. So we've been sponsoring kids for the past few years but this year we are like intentionally and actively um, making a plan so we can raise funds to get more kids um, financed. The money raised from this special golfing event will act as a self-line providing assistance to those deserving people who might otherwise encounter impossible challenges to pursue the academic goals. The Sea Biscuit Johannesburg Chef School's Golf Day Challenge proved that amazing changes are possible when a community works together by raising money as well as hope. In life, we all go through things and we need to be given a second chance. So the basis of and the narrative and the story behind the Seabiscuit Foundation is to be giving children or, or individuals who come from previously disadvantaged backgrounds a second chance, a leg up to doing something. You know, a lot of the times we, we see people in the chefing industry, they're on TV, they're living these glamorous lives and we're like, how do we get there? You know, you're a little girl from Ekasi or a boy who's sitting there, you know, wondering, how can I get there? And this is one of those great opportunities that can allow for that. Through this activity, the school continues to serve a role model showing how important it is to give back in order to create a better future. For Soweto TV Sports News, I am Katle Hobusilele.